This week's feast. Honey wasabi gummies from Wee Bear Bears. Happy holidays, everybody. We hope you had an amazing Christmas, Kwanzaa, Hanukkah, whatever you celebrate. Hopefully it was with friends and family and hot cocoa. This week, we have a very interesting feast for you guys. We Bear Bears comes back again for the third time on the show. Yep, but you guys asked for it, so we're giving it to you. That's right, honey wasabi gummies. Stop! Give me that and spit those out. <laughs> You're not even eating them right. Here you go. They're a little spicy. <gasps> Oh my gosh, you guys, these are so good! Can, can we have another? Sure! But first, Jimmy, why are we in this weird kitchen? Oh, we are in this new kitchen today because it is actually the kitchen of our office. That's right, normally Ashley and I film from my apartment, but we wanted to give you guys a little bit of a tour and an update video that's going to be coming out soon. But it's a nice kitchen, it's got a lot of space, and more importantly, enough space for us to craft up this bizarre and hopefully good tasting recipe. Yeah, don't worry guys, we'll be back in our normal kitchen. This is just a special occasion. You guys will find out all about that in the next video. So. Ho, 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 holiday cheer. Hopefully, yeah. there, hopefully there's like snow falling the whole time and a little like a light display right there. And then like a little Santa over there. And well, maybe a frosty over there. there. And then it's gone. And we're back in the kitchen. Back to the recipe. Honestly, it sounds pretty interesting. Uh, honey and wasabi, you don't think they typically go together, but maybe they do. Maybe they do. We will find out very soon indeed. Let's do it. To start our honey wasabi gummies, measure a quarter cup of half corn syrup and half honey and ooze in a dollop of wasabi before thoroughly mixing them together till it's all one. In a separate bowl, add powdered gelatin and a quarter cup of water and mix, then wait five minutes for the mixture to bloom. Pour in your honey wasabi mixture and continue stirring. When there are no visible chunks left, add in some food coloring and mix thoroughly. Now since this mixture isn't entirely smooth yet, we're going to stick it in the microwave for 15 second intervals for a total of six times, stirring in between until it's completely softened and liquidy. We use these candy gel molds for the gummy candy shape and it comes in all different shapes and sizes. Spray it with some non-stick spray, remove any excess with a paper towel, and carefully pour in your mixture to each mold. Now make sure to not fill it past the 3 quarters mark so it doesn't spill out when you're taking it in and out of the refrigerator. But first, let this sit at room temperature for 30 minutes, then into the refrigerator for another 30. Making any other color of gummies is super simple. Now we chose red to match the holiday spirit with our green wasabi gummies, but the end result is totally up to you. If you'd also like to make your gummies a little tangy, you can add some citric or tartaric acid to the mixture before putting it into the molds and letting it solidify. But you're probably not gonna need to do that because, well, this already has wasabi inside. Once your gummies are ready, carefully remove them from the molds, cleaning off any little bits and pieces that may have frozen over with them. You can powder these with sugar or just keep them as is. Add them to a small jar for some fun holiday presentation or just prepare them on the plate. And voila, honey wasabi gummies. No idea how this is gonna taste, but those wee bear bears really do know what they like, so hey, let's give it a whirl. Wow, pretty. So cool, honey wasabi. What a combination. Oh yeah. These bears will eat anything. Mm-hmm. We're uh, about to be those bears. I am about to be those bears. We... All right. Yeah? Bear bears. Mm. With that, cheers. Cheers, red and green, holiday spirit. Ooh. Whoa! The honey and the wasabi, they cut together in this strange, it's very interesting. Yeah, I taste wasabi first. And then honey. And then, and then wasabi. wasabi. It's very clean cut, one flavor, then melt the into the next, and then the next. Yeah, it's like a it's like a roller coaster where you go up and you go down. I think we should try up. one more. Okay. The green one? Yeah. The green one has more wasabi in it. By accident. Or was it? Whoa wasabi! <coughs> Whoa honey. Clears the nasal passages, that's for sure. But it's also sweet and gummy. It is. I can see why the weed bears love this. You can? Yeah, Why? they just eat the the craziest assortment. They have ramen tacos. Are we right? bear bears part Asian? Uh, they could be. They must be, right? Because they love a bunch of Asian things. Yes. That's a good point. Calzones aren't necessarily. That's true. That's true. They're equal opportunity. Yeah. 
My favorite bear, of course, Ice Bear. He keeps it cool, you know, get it? <laughs> All right. All right, so this is interesting. You guys, <laughs> <laughs> you guys wanted it, and so here it is. We put it in a cute little jar, too, mm -hmm. um, because you could wrap some ribbon around it and give it to your best friend for Christmas. Yeah. So happy holidays, everyone. You know, you can make them any color while you're at it. You do not have to make them green and red. And yeah. where did this lone gummy come from? That's the one that dropped on the table, thanks to me. I'll oh, take okay. that and roll it away. Ooh. <laughs> Thanks everybody for watching. We love you all so much. We hope you have a very safe and happy holiday season. Stay yep. warm. Yep. Stay hum comfy. Stay cool. Stay cool. And don't forget, leave us a comment in the comment section below. What do you want to see us make next for 2019? We're almost That's to the new right. year. Right. Almost to the new year. Thank you guys so much for all of your love and support and dedication to this channel for the last seven years. That's right. And don't forget subscribe, hit the little notification bell, and follow us on our social medias and all that good stuff. All of the above, and we'll see you next year. Bye. Bye.